Welcome to CLI. In this training video, I am going to walk you through the SQL Express installation. SQL Express needs to be installed before installing the CLI Device Manager tool. The first thing we need to do is browse to the CLI website at www.computerlab.com. And once we're there, let's select the Support tab. Scroll down and here we'll select the View Device Manager Downloads. And then scroll down again. And as you notice here, there are five files. Uh, four of them are for the SQL database uh, for either 32-bit or 64-bit. So you have to know which operating system you're running on your PC. In my case, it's the 64-bit version of Windows 7. So I'll be selecting the 64-bit uh, native client installer and we'll save that and then also the SQL Express Lite version here that's available and save that and then once those are completed we will go and look at our downloads in the download folder I also want to show you where you can find the documentation that will give you all the same steps that I'm providing for you in this uh, video demonstration. Simply select Documents, uh, then All Documents. Scroll down again, and right here, the second from the top, is your Device Manager Admin Guide. This is a PDF file of the uh, Device Manager documentation. And as you can see, it will have all the screenshots uh, that you need to download uh, this tool for you. And I'm going to demonstrate all of these steps and sequences here as we go along. All right, so looking in the Downloads folder, we see the two SQL files required to install the SQL Express database. So let's get started. First, select the SQL Express file. and select run and we'll see the extracting files and that should take a second and we'll be ready for the next step and here's our first window what we need to do here is simply accept the terms and conditions and click next then click install on this window Next. And here's our welcome installation window. We'll just click Next. And we've gone through that very well. And click Next. At this point, you're going to be asked to put a name uh, for the registration and company. Got my name in here already. We'll put CLI for the sake of the exercise. And continue. Click Next on this screen. Leave this the way it is and click Next. And also this window. Leave it the way it is and click Next. Again, uh, just leave the defaults. And now you're ready to install. I'm going to pause the video at this point and let this complete and then we'll continue once it's finished. And this part of the installation has completed so we'll click the next window here and click finish. Alright, step one is complete. The next file to install is the SQL native client. There may be a higher version on your PC. Uh, if there is, it'll tell you uh, that. And uh, it'll finish much quicker. In this case, that's what happened on this computer. 
And so we'll just click OK and click Finish. So we have successfully installed the SQL database. In our next video, I will walk you through the process of installing the CLI Thin Client Remote Management Tool. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please give us a call or send us an email. Thank you.